hi guys welcome back to my channel i'm so excited to be back um it's been over a year and i hope this time i'm going to be so consistent and actually make this channel grow and i hope that you guys are going to subscribe and those who are already subscribed thank you so much and i hope you are happy to see me <laughs> but anyway so guys i'm back i'm back if you're new on the channel my name is Gigi this is this is a lifestyle and travel channel and a little bit of fashion here and there so i'm gonna start this vlog with a i'm so nervous i'm not my first video i'm a little bit nervous but it's because i haven't been in front of the camera for a very long time but anyway I'm gonna start this vlog with a, a haul. It's a, a collective haul. So it's um, stuff from Zara, Machine, um, Sports C, and HM, and Galaxy Boy. So let's play, get right into it. <laughs> okay, so let's start with accessories. Okay. I'll start with this um, Galaxy Boy item. Um, I've got the, the I love the packaging. The packaging is so, so amazing. Let me just stop there for a second. This is uh, it's not done. Okay, so I'm going to start this haul with the um, item accessories. An item from Galaxy Gal and Boy. <laughs> Gal and Boy. Um, it's a South African brand if you know, don't know of it. They make like replicas of, not like replicas, dupes of mostly um, Louis Vuitton. And now I'm seeing a lot of, um, I think, Gucci as well. So I got these earrings. Um, this is the packaging. I'm just trying to hide my nails. Um, this packaging. So these are the. The neck, the earrings. I love them, love them, love them. I haven't, honestly, I haven't tried them on. I think these will look good when I have um, a weave on or um, my natural hair, which is a pixie cut. Um, I just hope they, they look good. And let's go. I've got these. I was influenced. I'm really not um, into kitten heels, but I was influenced because these shoes really make sense when you're really wearing like um, straight leg or white leg trousers or jeans, and I wear mostly those. So I felt like this is these are perfect for my wardrobe. Um, but these are the, the heels. These are from Foshimi. Um, Yeah, I love them. I love them. I love them. I, I'm not crazy about them when I'm wearing um, uh, much more skinny jeans, um, like ankle grays, grays uh, or ankle grays. Uh, uh, <laughs> I'm not feeling them. I'm really, really not feeling them when I'm wearing that. So I'm gonna try them on. I've seen them on people wearing them with wide legs, and it's perfect, 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 perfect. So I'm just gonna see how they look on me when I'm wearing um, those jeans or trousers. And then. From from sports scene, I've got these sneakers. These sneakers are they make sense for my wardrobe. I haven't been buying sneakers because I just feel like for me sneakers are very expensive. It's a very expensive purchase. Um, so the reason why I purchased new sneakers is because I am oh I've gained weight, so my foot. So I'm no longer like a size four, I'm a size five now. So most of my shoes and my sneakers don't fit, so I have to hand them down to my sister. So I had to really get them on sneakers. So I got this pair and I've also got the editor sample I'm wearing them now, so I'm kind of like lazy to take them off. Um, I've got the sample rose instead of the normal sandals, the OGs and the vegan. So anyway, so this is the reason why I got these sneakers. They also do come in a black and white, but I, I gravitated more towards these ones. They're more on the girly side in comparison to the black and white ones and these are the i think it's the gamma 
the Nike Gamma. Um, yeah, so they retail for one eight nine nine, and then from Zara. Face, 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 face. I'm literally collecting these shoes. Like, I missed the black pay and I got the black pay from. I think I get the black before. But I have a black pay, but it's not from Zara. And then I have the orange pay and I got a pay from the fix. But I don't like that one. I'm gonna give them away. But, okay, please guess that. I got these ones. Gold. This is a staple shoe. This is a staple shoe. This is like one of the, one of those pairs of shoes that or sandal that you need in the wardrobe in the black or in the white in the, all the colors that Zara has. This you will wear with everything. If I could wear the orange one with each and every most of my outfits, you can imagine the gold. This will good, look good on a date night and a brunch with the girls, lunch with the girls, solo date, whatever. These are perfect. These retailed for they went up guess what because initially they were $7.99 but now they are $9.59 um yeah but they are a little bit tight here I don't know if it's just me but I feel like they're a little bit uncomfortable on the on the strap line but I'll get over it um staying with Zara and on the gold side I've got these um let's see in the sale though I got these um on the summer sale um I got it for three fifty nine I'm just into gold sandals they just work with everything like I don't have to stress about the colour or anything like that any colour that I wear in summer will these will be the perfect um sandals to pay them with and then I think I'll add the, the rest of my my order it hasn't been to me as yet so I'm going to use another um, pair of heels and perfumes and then we going to H and M but please this is a cotton material and it was on sale for 170 from 99. It comes in various colors. This is the color that I gravitated towards. Um, it also comes in a uh, uh, an orangish, black and orange, and a mauve color, like a purplish, you know, um, color. Um, the only sizes which were available was um, three quarter and single. I'm not sure if you're gonna get the other sizes in the other stores, but the one in table they more only had um, single and three quarter. And I also got this dress, but I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep it. I'm just gonna see it when I'm wearing a spandex. If it's gonna give, but it's not giving that is spandex. Um, it's not giving. Just this, it's got like a little sleeve. Um, it's a long dress, it's got a slit at the back. It's a maxi dress, but it's not like maxi, maxi, maxi. Um, it's just by the ankle, and that's what it's retail for. So, yeah, that's the end of this haul. Um, yeah, so I'll see you when I'm going out for lunch. I'll be, I'll be, I'll be reviewing uh, a sushi. So these are my ingredients. So I'm gonna make spicy chicken liver and scrambled eggs and sourdough um, bread. So I'll be using onions. Um, I've soaked my livers in milk. That's what the cooks say because I've never I, I wasn't doing this. And then tomato paste, um, some nando sauce because I wanted I want my livers to be spicy. This is optional, really. Uh, mild curry, Spanish, paprika, um, onion powder, Cajun seasoning, six gun, crushed um, garlic, and this is for my scrambled eggs, and this is the sourdough. 
I just noticed that um, my cream is expired. So I have to come up something. I'll probably mix like a little bit of flour and milk so that I can get a nice um, yeah mixture. And I, it, it will work. It will work. I'll just make like white sauce. Not like really like white sauce, white sauce. But like I'll make white sauce. I'm whispering because I don't want to make noise because Bobby is still sleeping. But anyway, um, let's cook. this Zara jacket dupe from Aliexpress um it's um it was I'll tell you all the details when I'm there but I know it's over it's not even a half price it's more than that you know and then this is how it looks and then I've got this um Zara t-shirt crop t-shirt I think um white t-shirt I've got these jeans from H&M and I'm wearing my sandals and I'm gonna carry oh, this is a mess and I'm gonna carry my Zara bag I'm gonna wear shades um yeah because it, uh, so know, this is not giving but whatever my rings are also from Sheen and then oh let me just get my perfume quickly I'm gonna put on my Chanel Gabriella it's perfect Perfect, perfect, perfect. Check it out when I get to the restaurant. I'm hoping that I do a, a proper outfit check when I'm there because I'm not even sure. I can't even see myself. So this is a these are the disadvantages of actually shooting from your camera, from your phone because you can't see yourself because you need to use the back camera to get the perfect um perfect quality. So I'm out and I'm out. I'm out and I'm out and I'm out. Bye. Yo, 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 yo. One thing about it down here, guys, it is cold. It is windy. Oh. 
so early i'm so so early my bus was super early so i'm just gonna go straight to the restaurant i'm not gonna wait for my friend she's just leaving home but she lives very close <gasps> Friends, what's what? Um, let's see. Isn't it the crispy? What is the California? So that's the crispy. Yeah. Uh -uh, that's crispy. Okay, that's crispy. And then the bam bam roll is which one? Oh, Tempura prawn with avo, drizzled yeah. with mayo. It's that one. Tastes good. Tastes good. We must do like a, a, a cheers with our tacos. <laughs> yeah. What? Vlogging like this? So this morning I was trying to vlog. Yo, auntie. Well, my, you think that? Yes. My tripod doesn't have the thing to put my phone. It only has like the thing to to mount my camera. I was so mad. What do you mean? There's not something to put, like I can't put my phone like this, that thing where you put your phone in. Like, to connect them? Yeah. Not necessarily, like to keep it there so that I don't hold my phone like this. Oh, but you can most of Yo, I was so bored. And all along, I forgot that it was initially on my, in my, my light, whatever you call that light. And that's the one oh. I told my mom. That's the one, like, I told my mom to... I don't, I don't think I like this one, these sushis with the nut fried. Doesn't taste nice. Yes, thank you. It, it tastes like watered down lemonade. This pop don't don't mm. taste a bit no? What does it taste like a samosa? Mm -mm. It does? Mm -mm. I'm telling you. I think when you have a problem with some things that are in gravy or such. Mm -mm. It's too. It tastes very fishy. And it doesn't taste like salmon in there. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. It tastes beefy, mincy. Ah, boy, like Okay, now I'm tasting what you're tasting. Okay, so it's not bad. For me, it doesn't taste like 
it's more on the meaty side of things not fish not seafood it doesn't taste like seafood one thing about this lemonade in Busan it's not nice it's like watered down you know, it's like water no? like a sun a whole leaf Lemon water, basically. No, but like, like properly infused, like for for months. Oh my God, just for months and months and months. Yo, I guess another sushi is so big. I'm really enjoying this. Uh huh. Ten over ten. Minus nothing. Mm -hmm. I think I would order this tiger box. I mean, if I was, if I could like order a box. Let's take a work. You want to calculate Sana? You will like this. They will help themselves. Oh, this is Jet Lounge. I will see it on Instagram. This side. Taking a walk. How was lunch, Rihanna? <laughs> no. Okay, how is the food? Let me be specific. How is the food? The what food we... was okay. It was... It wasn't as many as I thought it was going to be. Which I'm happy about. And then... How much would you rate the... The tacos? We almost here. We here. Can I give my real feedback? Yeah, obviously. Feedback? No, no. My feedback will be my feedback. Two. Two out of five, no? And then the popsicles. Zero. Zero. Minus Hi, one. Bo. My <laughs> minus. And then minus. the tiger box. Two. Two and a half. Maybe. Okay. So for me, the salmon um tacos, it was a Two and a half because I'm not big on on salmon and I like the fact that it wasn't overpowering so I enjoyed that about it and then the popstickers were like more meaty it felt, felt like I was eating something beefy so also a two and a half and then the tiger a box prawn tiger box was a four because I love prawn, I love prawn, I love prawn, I like um, crispy prawn. So yeah, so now we're on our way, we were walking, we are walking, we're at Bougie outside. And then we're gonna go in and have a cocktail, I'll have a cocktail. Is it open? Bye? Three o'clock, okay. Okay, the opening at three. What time is it getting? What time is it? Ten. Oh, maybe ten minutes. Okay, it's perfect. And then we're gonna go into a um, restaurant bougie just to have a drink at two and then I'm gonna go home. So I just got home, um just changed into my gown so that I can do my um my face. So I'm gonna try out a face mask from Woolies and I also wanna try um also heavenly foot mask as well i'm probably not, not going to do that on camera because i don't want this video to be long i'll just show you the foot mask i'll be using and then yeah so i'm just gonna wipe off my my lipstick and wash my cleanse my face and then i'll apply the mask with you guys in a bit okay 
I'm rushing because color shading. Um, I think in the next five minutes, just want to apply quickly um, and then give you a quick review because we were walking and you know, so I couldn't give you a good review um, of Sushi Box. Yeah, it's quite short and now I have to hold it with one hand so let me show you quickly so this is the mask I'll be using I'm trying this out it's the skin boost gel mask with vitamin E and C awakens tight looking skin let me see I bought it quite a, a while ago Okay, hope it's not expired. So I need to let me see. Need to use it. Leave it on for 10 to 15 minutes and rinse off using liquid water. So I've never used a gel mask before. <laughs> no, it's shaping. I never used a gel mask before. So I'm gonna try that. I'm also using I'm using this, uh, what do you call this, applicator or brush or whatever it is from Sane Organic. I'm not sure if it's how you pronounce it. So I got this from Sane Organic. It is 30 Rand from Ray Egg. So guys, I um, hope you listen clearly. I'm really new to the sushi game. Um, I've been eating sushi probably for a year now, not two years. This is quite a lot. This is quite a lot. I'm just like tea green, but then you should be like, this is quite a lot. God, yeah, that's what I'm thinking. So, yeah, I'm just like. So aesthetics, um, to be honest, you, you can't go there for aesthetics, like there's nothing. You can sit outside maybe and try to work around the street, you can take maybe like people are having photo shoots in that street, maybe you can do that, but in the restaurant it's not for aesthetics, if you want to go for a cute date, it's not the cute date place. Um, it's just one of those um, restaurants where you say to a person, please, um, Let's just go eat some sushi quickly and then you're gonna go somewhere else. You know, like 
we wanted to go to excuse me, we wanted to go to Gucci to have a I wanted to have a drink because she uh, she doesn't drink. My friend doesn't drink so then it's like that vibe. So you just eat and go. There's like there's nothing more to the restaurant, honestly. I think it's the best spot to actually um order takeaways, you know. Because the sushi is good, you know. And it's affordable, it's inexpensive. I wouldn't yeah, it's inexpensive. Um so if I could rate the the food, right? I enjoy the the tracker box. I can even say it's a four. Or yeah, it could be a four, you know? And then the tacos are like three because I didn't taste the salmon. The salmon wasn't strong. And I'm happy because I'm not a salmon person. Um, Lana has been trying to, you know, make me like it, but I'm, ugh, she's not winning, you know. I'm really not a salmon person. I don't know why, maybe if it's cooked salmon, maybe, but roast salmon, it, ugh, it's not a thing. So I enjoy the tacos more than Rihanna because Rihanna likes salmon and the salmon wasn't coming through. The, the taste of the salmon wasn't coming through, so she didn't. specific street but like the surrounding streets there's parking there and yeah if you want to have happy afterwards there's a restaurant next to it I forgot what the restaurant's name is you can go there for happy but they can't have alcohol because I'm there um, and I think I'm because I asked um, I was passing so yeah I, I really can't say much about the place I would really enjoy it. 
um, just to get away from having coke but it looks a waste of it's just a waste um, I would go back but I would order just the sushi and maybe 